In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hun. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Hey, my turn, big guy. That's the face I fell in love with. Thanks, Codsworth. Of course. Grognak the Barbarian and the Jungle of the Bat Babies. <laughs> right. Hey, hun. Wow. Look at you. How'd a guy like me ever get so lucky, huh? I know we were nervous at first, but I'm glad we got caught. Saddle up Salisbury steak. Rated A plus.
Hun? Do I look nervous? I look nervous, don't I? Uh, it's that salesman again. I don't know why he keeps bothering you. Let Codsworth take care of it. Codsworth? I'll be sweeping up the floors later. Maybe if we ignore him, he'll go away. Voltec announced a continuation of their popular Welcome Home promotion. They report openings are still available at Area Vaults 81, 111, and 114. Since debuting Vault 76 last year, in honor of America's tercentenary, Voltec continues to expand with plans for well over 100 vaults around the country. He's still there. What kind of... Good morning! vault calling. Go on. Nice to find you, ma'am. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency. I assure you. What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, ma'am, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid. And coming sooner than you may think. If you catch my meaning... Now, I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being, um, <laughs> a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. But I have a family. You can fit us all, right? Of course, of course. Minus your robot, naturally. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. Come back some other time. Come on, hon. It's just a little paperwork. Let him fill it out, and it's done. It's just... nuclear war, really? Could that actually happen? Of course not, but look. We have Sean to think of now.
come on. It's not like anything's gonna happen. I know, but it's like insurance. Just in case. For Sean, you know? Yes, right. Just like insurance. So let's get to it. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Hey, hun. I can't believe it's almost Halloween. We need to finish making Sean Sean custom. has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that maternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> Go ahead, honey. I'll be there in a second to help, okay? Giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, I fixed that mobile on his crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? That's my boy. On his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time, anyway. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah. Sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Hun? What's wrong with Codsworth? Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. Wait, we seem to what? have lost contact with what our did he say? stations. Oh no. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh I'm right here! Go! We need to get to the vault. Now! Let's go! Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. On the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, sir. You two, Good follow God, me. Come on. on. What's going to happen to all those people outside We're the gate? We're doing everything we can. Now keep moving. Step on the platform in the center. Almost there! 
Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Oh my god! in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. Hey, hon. If we left a minute later... <gasps> no, we'd no. all be. Don't get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these stairs and through the door there. We made it. Take a vault suit, then head down the hall. Hun? It's gonna be okay, right? Right over there, please. Just step over to the table. Yeah, looks fine. One vault suit. Now just head down the hall. Each of you take one of these. Your brand new vault suits. Take a suit. Thanks. But now, just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. See? This is our new home. It's gone. Our Excuse home. me. Oh, you're gonna Everything love it. Had. This mm -hmm. is one of our most advanced facilities. Oh, None of the others aren't great, what mind they you. Make How this long way, do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. It's a good fit. Don't yeah, you think? Checking the vault suit is designed to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Just step in here. Excuse me. Just step into the chamber. It'll be okay. Mommy's right here. See? Honey? The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three, two, one. Thank <laughs> you. 
everything's gonna be fine. I got it. Let the boy go. I'm only gonna tell you once. I'm not giving you shot! Roaches? What the hell? What happened here? Where is everyone? Terminal somewhere. This all that's left? Is anyone alive? Did anyone get out?
God, why would vault -Tec do this? I can't be the only one left. Hello? Anyone? Come on. There has to be a release. Oh. They're... They're dead. Why did they do this? Oh. They're... They're dead. Malfunction in cryopod manual release override. Come on, come on, come on.
Oh, God. Am I the only one left? Am I the only one left? <laughs> 